Good evening, Nivla here again. Another nightcap night. Back to Scotland this time as usual. This is a McClellan's Lowland single malt Scot which Scotch whisky. Doesn't actually say which distillery because McClellan's doesn't have a distillery. But its parent company is Bowmore Morrison. And the only Bowmore Morrison distillery in the Lowlands area is Ockentoshan. So I should imagine that this is a young Ockentoshan. If you haven't heard of Ockentoshan, there is a, an Ockentoshan. This photo is of me at the Ockentoshan distillery in Glasgow visited in August 2007 and uh, a fabulous place it was too. Anyway, let's try the McClellan's Lowland single malt. No age statement, which is why I think it's probably a young Ockentoshan. Nice dark straw colour. Very clean and appealing. And I get, I get quite a bit of grassiness. Like if you walk through um, a field of grass and you break off a few stems. It's that sort of grassiness. And there's a bit of citrus, probably, probably orange. And there's definitely some vanilla on the nose. That's really nice. There's um, quite a bit of hint of sherry, which is probably the casks that this uh, this whiskey's been put in, and um, it's a creaminess and it's really pleasant. And the finish sort of hangs around for quite some time. Now this is a pleasant start whiskey. If you don't know much about whiskey, don't buy Johnny Walker Red. Buy a bottle of this. It's around about $50, so it won't break the bank. And yet it's a really nice introduction to single malt whiskies. McClellan's actually make four different varieties. There's this one, the Lowland. There's one called Highland. One from Speyside. And one from Islay. So, a nice whiskey. Give it a try if you can see it. See you next time.